Barco's lead-lit rear projection systems come with an advanced heat management system that effectively doubles the lifetime of your video wall. High temperatures on the LEDs can affect your video wall's performance, lower light output, color shift and reduce lifetime. That is why efficient heat management is crucial for LED-based rear projection systems. One way of cooling down the LED light source is by leading the heat away from the LED via a copper plate connected to heat pipes. However, a copper plate only has limited heat absorption capacity. As a result of the very high temperatures of a LED, the copper plate presents a heat bottleneck. Heat pipe systems are therefore not efficient to cool a LED-based rear projection video wall. Extensive tests at the Rensselaer Lighting Research Center in New York have shown that the lifetime of a LED can be doubled by lowering the heat on the LED junction by 10 degrees. Heat pipe systems cannot manage this. Therefore, Barco looked for other proven technologies to solve this heat issue. The result is an advanced heat management system based on liquid cooling that efficiently reduces LED temperatures by an additional 10 degrees. With this system, the lead carrier plate is directly cooled by coolant. As coolant has a much higher heat transfer capacity than copper, there is no more bottleneck. By varying the speed of the jet stream, in principle any temperature level can be achieved. This technology has been successfully applied by major PC manufacturers. In addition, Barco's liquid cooling system doesn't need many heavy fans to drive heat away from the lead source. Less fans also mean less noise, a prerequisite for a stressless and operator-friendly control room environment. In short, the advanced heat management system based on liquid cooling from Barco efficiently reduces lead temperature by an additional 10 degrees. This makes your lead video wall live longer and it reduces the noise level in your control room. Barco's heat management system is based on proven standard technology.